Hey guys, it's Jill. Hope you're all having an awesome day. Today is another try on haul. Super excited for this one. Super nervous as well. This is Shein, Shein. And I watched a couple hauls and the, for the most part all of them were like not very plus size friendly. So we will see. We will see. Um, I went ahead and made a purchase. Here's my box. It's huge. It's going to be a super long haul. Get a snack, get you a drink, get you some wine, whatever you whatever you want. Because um, we're going to try on some clothes together and we're going to see how they fit. I will tell you the sizes. I will tell you the <clears throat> prices. Um, if you guys aren't subscribed, please subscribe. Hit that notification bell. bell. I have lots of try on hauls coming up. And if you're not using Ebates, Links down below. Use it. If you're not, it's free cash money back. Literally. On your, all your online shopping purchases. So, let's go ahead and dig in and get started. And let's just start pulling stuff out. So the first thing is this. I want to say this is the dress that has the little tie backs in the back. I'm kind of nervous about because, yeah, it is. Um, ooh. Yes, if you, if you are offended by the fact that I say you guys a lot, just go ahead and click on this video because I say it a lot. Didn't even realize I said it until someone pointed it out. Um, I'm trying to see. This is like a tie back, so I'm wondering if I'm going to be able to get this on myself. We'll see. Let's try it on. Okay, so this is what I'm thinking. I'm thinking that it goes around, and then you've got this little flap on the side, and so then you put this long string that goes around your neck in here, and then maybe from there, you can kind of tie it around. Let's see, because I've I've watched one haul, because I didn't want to watch too many hauls um, on this stuff, because I wanted to you know make my own opinion on it. But um, I saw one person, and she was like, "This was a pain in the butt to put on." So I wish that she kind of would have showed it. So I was like, "You know what? If I can get this, I'm going to show y'all how to do it." Hopefully, we won't have to you know, need someone else to do it for us. No, that's supposed to go down there. So, let's pull. <gasps> Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> uh, I did not tell you what size this was. Does it say on the package? This is a 2XL, by the way. Okay, so what did I do wrong? Run through. There we go. Okay, no, this is supposed to go under. Okay. I feel like you tie this one together because then you have this one right here to tie around as well. Oh y'all, this one's long. I'm 5'4 for reference. It's very long. This is freaking beautiful. Like, I'm so ready to go on a cruise with this dress. Like, seriously. For one, it is really, really, really long. I'm 5'4", so this is just one of those dresses. <clears throat> Either you get it tailored or you have to wear heels. I don't even know if wearing heels would really help. So let's see. Yeah, this is something I would personally probably have to get tailored, but this is so pretty. As you guys can see, I did and I was able to get it on myself. This is definitely something that you don't want to really wear a bra with. If you can fit in one of those little Instagram bras where it just literally sticks to your boobs, that would definitely be the best. But I love this. Let me see if I can find my invoice. It unfortunately does not have any prices on it, but I will find the prices and put them on the screen. I will also link everything down below for you guys. <laughs> this dress, y'all, this dress. 
like I said, I feel like it would definitely look better in the back as far as like if someone else were to have helped me. But I totally did this all on my own because I don't have another, another adult in this, in this house to help me. Um, this is pretty. This is really pretty. Like, I love it. It's also a little see-through, so I would just say maybe wear some nude underwear and you should be okay. I feel really pretty in this. I'm not going to lie. I really do. You guys, I literally don't want to take this off. I'm not even kidding. Do you see how pretty this is? And it just gives, like, it adds just, like, the little perfect amount of, like, skin shown. <laughs> uh, beach vacation. Let's go. I'm coming for you. This, I believe, is a two top. This is in the size 2X and yes it's just a little crop top. This looks cute. Okay let me go put on some shorts or something. I'll be right back. First off the bat, I will say this is like pretty good quality. Um, I do see one string hanging here. String police over here. But other than that, I don't see anything else. So let's be super careful with this and not get all the makeup that I'm wearing on this shirt. Ooh, this is cute. It is a little tight around here in the fact that I mean like I feel like it's going to keep coming up if you have large arms this is definitely not going to fit you um because there's not a whole lot of space in the arm this is cute y'all excuse my super wide stomach yes but yeah it's cute actually now that I think of it I mean it just comes up as I lift my arms so it's not tight I think it actually fits really well like I said, this is a 2X. And it's just like a really cute basic crop top. It's cute. Really cute with some high-waisted shorts or jeans. I just have leggings on today. But yeah, cute. Okay, next thing. I don't know why I picked out this color because every time I do, I'm always like, it just doesn't look good against my skin tone. But this is a 2XL. Um, and it's just this really pretty dusty rose that is halter style with the little ruffles and a little zipper in the back. And it's um, kind of sheer, but has that double layer. Yes, it is double layered. So let's go ahead and try it on. Okay, so this one is a 2XL. It fits a little snug around my stomach. And I am noticing around here, it does show my bra a little bit, but I think once you kind of like just adjust the ruffles it kind of isn't a big deal I mean I don't know no I was gonna say this might be office appropriate but then as I tried it on I was like no because of the whole bra showing there but it's I mean it's pretty I actually really like it like I said it's a not like super snug around my stomach um, it'll definitely look much better with some jeans on or some shorts or maybe a skirt or something but this is really pretty it just goes around the top so far i feel like i'm having really good luck with their sizing um everything has been a 2x so far and that is pretty much my norm i don't know if it's because it's contrasting against this tan line or what but i feel like this is actually not washing me out i'm also darker now so that could be it too but i really like this yeah, I've been working out and my shoulders are like coming back full effect. I'm like, yes, I have really good shoulders. I'm not trying to take my own horn here or anything. But this is pretty. I like it. A little like date night, a little flirty date night. Mm-hmm. I like it. You guys, I have died and gone to heaven. This, oh my gosh. Oh, oh my gosh. I'm so speechless speechless literally speechless this is a 2x the only tiny itty bitty little tiny complaint that I have is that because this kind of flares out a little bit on the side it does make your hips look a little bit bigger um, that's not necessarily always a bad thing 
Um, I don't mind it personally for me. Um, some of you might, especially if you have bigger hips and you're like, no, I don't want. But if you don't have bigger hips and you want the illusion that you have bigger hips, this is the top for you. <sighs> Seriously? Oh my gosh. I can't even right now, you guys. I can't even. This is so incredibly beautiful. This quality, the quality of the shirt is good, y'all. It is thick. Um, at first I was like, ooh, I don't know about this because it's a little too thick for summer. But really it's not. For a night out, oh my gosh. I am seriously in love with this top. This is everything. The whole asymmetrical line right here, how it um, has no strap here and then it's got the strap here. And then the fact that it's like so like fluttery and oh my gosh. And then the peplum with more ruffles. It's just, it's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I feel like this makes me look smaller except for in the hips. I love this shirt. I don't think I can say enough how much I love this shirt. I wish that I could figure out a way to cover up this tan line. Like it comes in on the waist, you guys. Yes, I said it. Oh my gosh. This is beautiful, beautiful. You have to get this, you guys. Have to, have to, have to. A must. Okay, so before I take the shirt off and try on something else, I have to say like it does smell like BO, which is really disappointing. Now, I will say there's like this laundry enhancer that I use that gets out like nasty smells, but if it's like actually in the fabric, it might not get it out. I don't know. It doesn't smell good. Like, it smells like BO and dye, which is so disappointing because this shirt is what dreams are made of. This is like, this encompasses Jill 100%. I'm really disappointed. I'm really, really, really disappointed. Because, <clears throat> I mean, I can try it with the laundry enhancer. <sighs> I just don't know. But I wanted to let you guys know that. If it's not a deal breaker, it's not anything to wear. Like, someone's going to be like, oh, you stink. But, you know, if you're on a date and you wear this, you don't want your date to, like, hug on you and then be like, oh, what does that smell? <sighs> This is really disappointing. Okay, let's turn on the next shirt. I, again, I am speechless. This shirt doesn't smell. Mm -mm, no, size 2X, oh my gosh. All right, the thing I like about this too is that you can either put it, you guys, I just can't. This, this color is gorgeous. It's looking so pretty against my tan. You can either put it up on your shoulder or you can leave it off on your shoulder, off of your shoulder. You have the little tiny skinny um, strap over here. You've got the ruffles on the sleeve coming down and it goes around. Oh my gosh. It's peplum. It is gorgeous. This, oh my goodness. Like, if I were to be going on a date anytime soon, which I'm not, but if I were, this would be the shirt I would be wearing. This would be the shirt I'm wearing if I'm going out dancing anytime soon, which I don't know that I am. I might be. I don't know. This is gorgeous. Again, size 2X. Um, this has plenty of room. Um, if your shoulders are like a little wider, they might not fit. I just... Oh, by the way, if you need a strapless bra, go to Avenue. I will link the video at the end, and I will also link it up on the screen right now so you guys can go check it out. But I will also link this down below. This is the best strapless bra. I have never, as a plus-size woman, been able to find a strapless bra that doesn't have, like, that huge gapping. So if you guys want it, 40 bucks. At one point, it was on sale for 16 so maybe it goes on sale. I don't know much about Avenue at all. I just randomly went in there one day tried on the bra because I was like I'm in I'm in the market for a strapless bra maybe I'll have luck and I had I hit the jackpot with this it's amazing so all of these cute clothes I mean if you have amazing boobs and don't need a bra then you're not gonna need one but I know I do so so this one is a 2x as well and again I absolutely love it 
Um, I do notice that it does have that kind of bio scent. I was about to say, I was just pulling on this and it seemed like it was like coming undone, but no, it's fine. Um, <clears throat> how pretty is this? It's really, really, really pretty. <sighs> but again, it has that smell. I really wonder if that laundry enhancer that I have, the laundry enhancer takes out like sunken odors like mildew and, you know, like when you have like things that smell really bad. I really love that other black top and I really love this one too. And I would really hate to take these back. But I also really would hate to be on a date and to like hug someone and then be like, you know what I mean? But just this detail, it's so beautiful. Um, it covers everything. You're not showing too much skin. I love all of these cutouts. Again, it's black. It has a beautiful peplum. This is a 2X, so it fits great. Um, <clears throat> here's the back of it, just really plain. I don't think, yeah, there's nothing on the back, like no cuts or anything. All right, so I don't know why I got this top in a 3X, but this one is in a 3X. Maybe because it's a little shorter. I don't know, but let's go ahead and try it on. Now this one doesn't have that B.O. smell like the black ones do. Maybe it's just their black fabric. I don't know. Okay, so this one's really cute. It's got that asymmetrical hemline where it's shorter up here and then it goes longer here. It's got a split right here so it can show a little bit of skin. Um, it's off the shoulder. Or no, it's one shoulder so you got the asymmetrical again. Um, I'm, I'm kind of confused. Like I'm like... Maybe I should have went with a 2X, but the thing is, I feel like if I went with a 2X, maybe this would have been like super short, like it would have went like all the way up here. Um, but as far as like the 2X, it is kind of a little, a little loose. Like it's, yeah, it's loose right here. So this definitely, it's cute. Um, it's definitely not one of my favorites, but so on to dresses. This one is a size 2X, and as I took it out of the package, I'm like, what the heck is this? I'm, I'm assuming it's a, a wrap dress. So let's see if it fits. All right, so <clears throat> this is a wrap, wrap style. This is a 2X, and this is one of those wraps that if you, okay, if you're gonna make a wrap dress, you need to have something here that ties so this part stays together. Are we in agreement with this? I'm totally like, if you're going to have a wrap dress, you need to have a tie. So when you're walking, you're not afraid that you're just, your dress is just going to split open and show any lady bits. Whether you wear underwear, whether you don't, you still should not be afraid that when you're wearing a dress and you're walking, or even when you're sitting down, that you are going to be exposing yourself too much. Um... Then on to this. This is really weird. Maybe I haven't wrapped it right. I mean, but it's pretty self-explanatory, right? You literally just wrap. Um, it's really cute. It's, I guess it's supposed to be like that on the arms, but I feel like it's kind of big. It's just really big up top. Like this should be like up here. These should be right here, a little tighter around my arm. If you have a bigger chest and bigger arms, I think that this dress will be great for you. But see, I mean, well, I mean, the straps are adjustable. So I can adjust the straps. Hold on, let me just do that. Wow, do I feel stupid. <laughs> but because of that aspect and to show the adjustable straps, that lets you know that if you are bigger busted and you have bigger shoulders and bigger arms, then this strap adjusting will really make a huge difference. So I made it all the way as tight as I could. <clears throat> as you can see, my bra is still showing a little bit, but that's not a huge deal. You can literally just take a, what's it called? safety pin and that's the same thing that you can do for the wrap too so if you really like this dress there are things that you can do to kind of make it 
um, to where it's going to be addressed to where you're not feeling insecure and you're feeling like you know you're going to be busting out of your dress. Um, again, I just, I do, I really do wish that they would have put a string. You can actually just make, you, you can actually do that yourself. I don't know. I'm not that crafty, but I know it can be done. So this dress is, again, it's really cute. I love the hemline of it. It's, I'm a fan. <laughs> it's uh, longer in the back than it is in the front. And it's just really pretty. I will say the fabric is really thin, which isn't always a bad thing because in the summertime, you don't necessarily always want super heavy fabrics. It's actually not see-through. It's a really sweet dress. I really like it actually. And again, for the fact that it's like super light, I don't feel like pregnant or anything in it. I feel good. I feel cute. So yeah, this would be a really cute like, this is a really cute summer dress. Okay, for this one, I'm really, really, really glad that I sized up. Um, one thing I will say is that on me, this 3X is still like pretty tight around the stomach and hip area. That's not anything that some shapewear won't fix though. Um, I was like just looking at it in the, looking at myself at the side and I just noticed the kind of hanging of the stomach and I was like, okay, now I know you can't do much about this unless, you know, until I start getting smaller and smaller. But for now with this, get some shapewear and it kind of lifts it up and it'll definitely make it look so much better. I love this, you guys. I think it fits really well. Um, the pants are wide and they go right down to the floor so you can totally wear a heel, a wedge. This kind of has that scent a little bit, but not too, too much. Um, but you could totally put a belt on to kind of accentuate your waist even more if you wanted to. This is just really pretty. I think this would be great for a night out, like going to like a, a little bit of a fancier restaurant or for a wedding. Do you wear, can you wear black to a wedding? Yeah, I haven't been to a wedding in, in a really long time. Um, but yeah, I do wish, not going to lie, that it had pockets. But I do think that if it had pockets, it would kind of make it more casual. And this is kind of a more little dressy jumpsuit. So it's really, really pretty. Shane, I am very impressed. Do you know what would look amazing with this? A gold belt. You guys, a skinny gold belt and some gold shoes. <sighs> that would look amazing. I also did mention like the pretty ruffles up top. It's so pretty. And then the zipper. Can I show what it looks like in the back? Mm -hmm. Feel like going dancing now. I totally wouldn't dance in this, but you know what I mean. Okay, so this is a dress. Where is the rest of it? This is a 3X. I have a feeling this is not going to fit, but let's try it on anyways. Okay, so this one is quite interesting. Um, the straps fit a little weird. They are adjustable. I've already adjusted them. They're still kind of weird. This right here is supposed to wrap and like fit around your boob, right? But I'm pretty small already. Like, like I said, I sized up on this dress. This dress is a 3X. My boobs are pretty small already. So if I'm going to wear this, I'm going to have under boob all day long. Then if you wear it, obviously with a bra, you're going to have your bra completely showing. And then, wait, I think you're supposed to have your stomach showing a little bit. Yeah, this, this does not fit for one. So 3X does not fit. Fabric is extremely cheap. It's really thin. It's rough. It's got these strings hanging all over the place. Um, like I said, it fits weird. And I'm small up top. Like I don't have very big boobs. Oh, and this thing keeps coming undone. This strap. It does have like a little hook or whatever back here. Um, it does have like the elastic, so it gives you a little bit more stretch, but this is a big no, like just no. Mm -mm. And the pockets, why are you so small though? I don't know. Just no. 
So this is the dress. It's Look how gorgeous this is. It's a 2X and I'm looking at it and I'm like, I probably should have sized up. But let's just see. Okay, so I'm not going to lie. I like literally, literally squeezed into this thing. But oh my goodness. So like I said, this is a 2X. I really don't know why I did not size up. But this is gorgeous. This is again one of those dresses where you can either wear it to the side, like off your shoulder, or you can wear it on your shoulder. I think it's because it's a little more fancier and pretty. Oh my gosh. I think it's because it's a little more fancier. It should stay, like I would, I would personally leave it on the shoulder. This is a really, really good quality dress, you guys. Like it even has the little hook thing that those fancier dresses have. You know what I'm talking about? You know what I'm talking about? <sighs> This dress actually might work with some, um, what's it called? With some shapewear, just to kind of lift this and kind of suck me in a little, because this dress is really pretty. Like, look at it, it shows some leg, but not too much. <sighs> I feel really pretty in this, I really do. Like, I feel like, you can't tell me anything in this dress. Put on some dang shapewear and kind of not have it cling to that stomach so much and you can't tell me nothing in this dress. This dress is gorgeous. Gorgeous. Just gorgeous. Like, I would even say like this would be a really pretty bridesmaid's dress. Like if you're on a budget and your girls are on a budget, yeah, this is gorgeous. It's really stretchy too, by the way, guys. It's really, really stretchy. So you can move. I just feel so pretty in it. Like I really do. What y'all think? What y'all think? Wow. <laughs> Seriously, I don't know where I would wear this to, but ah, oh, you know. You know those cruises, you know all cruises have that fam like that really fancy night. This would be perfect. If you guys are going on a cruise, this would be perfect for that little formal night that they all have. Okay, so this is so pretty. This is again one of those more formal dresses. Um I feel so pretty. I love the ruching right here on the stomach. So if you do have a bigger stomach, it is gonna help camouflage it a little bit. Um, I love this little leg that you get to show, like it has this underlying right here of the dress and it goes all the way around, which is nice. Um, and it just opens right here so that way you can get a little, you can show a little leg, but it's not too much leg, it's still very conservative and it's long. This is a beautiful dress, it really is. If I were to keep this for something if I were to wear this for something formal, which is obviously what you would wear this to, um, I would definitely have to, I feel like I would have to get it altered just a tad bit up here, a little bit tighter, just a little tiny, tiny bit tighter. But other than that, this is a beautiful dress. It's really great quality. Um, Shein actually is a really great place if you're looking for more formal dresses to go to. This is so pretty. I feel really comfortable in it. The skirt does not ride up, so I'm not feeling like I'm having to tug down at it or anything. And this is just beautiful. Floor length, you show some leg. I love this right here. Like, I just love this little crisscross halter style. And then it just has a really simple basic back to it. So that's what it looks like in the back. This is really pretty. I really like it. And you guys, seriously, you just cannot beat these prices. I know I did not spend over $40 on a dress or a piece of clothing. So if you're on a budget, I mean, even if you're not on a budget, these more formal dresses are really good quality. I don't see strings hanging anywhere. The material's nice. It kind of sucks you in. This is good stuff. It's really good stuff. What can I say? This is gorgeous. I did size up on this one. It was a 3X. Um, I feel like I've had really, 
really good luck with sizing here. There's only one thing that didn't fit, right? This is gorgeous. Gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous. I'm not going to lie, I usually don't feel good in pantsuits just because of the way that my body is distributed and the weight and like my stomach and stuff, but I feel really good in this. Like really, really good. Um, the only thing I will say is that one thing is I can appreciate when companies do have adjustable straps, especially when it comes to the slow wrap style. Um, now it does show my bra a little tiny bit as you can see right there. That's not anything I'm like hugely concerned about because it's not a huge, a huge showing of it. But again, it's something you can literally just take a safety pin and just kind of safety pin it and there you go, bam, you're good to go. This fabric is light, it's breezy, it's not see-through from what I can see so far. Um, it's got the wide legs on the bottom, it's not too long. These would look great with a wedge. They would look great with a heel. I mean, this is beautiful. This is so, so, so pretty. There's the back of it. It just kind of um, zipped up. It just kind of zips up. And it does show my bra a little bit too, but that's not anything I'm concerned about because you know, my hair is usually down anyways. This is really pretty. Again, I feel super comfortable, super confident. You've got this little belt. You can either wear it with or wear it without. I personally like it with the little belt and I like it to the side. Um, this is beautiful. I can't say it enough. Like it's beautiful, it's pretty, it's gorgeous. I love it. I feel so confident in it. Y'all can't tell me nothing in this. Mm -hmm. Can't tell me nothing. Okay, so it actually does go on, but it is not zipping. Um, it's a really cute dress though. I will say this might actually be something where it was like, if you could just literally slip it over your head without having to do the whole zip, this would be a really pretty bathing suit cover up because it is very sheer, it's very see-through. And you guys, I don't even know if I wanna go back that far. Like, oh, it goes up super high. Like, super, super, super high. Let me just go ahead and turn around and show you the back. Um, like, literally, like, literally, it's right there. Like, I would literally be like, <laughs> hi, how you doing? <laughs> so yeah, this is how the top would fit or should fit if it were to fit, which is really pretty. I actually really like that, but it does not fit. So this is a 3X. You would probably, I would probably have to size it up to like a 5X, I would assume. Yeah, this is just one of those dresses that's just a big fat no. All right, so final thoughts. I am personally actually really impressed. For the amount of stuff that I got, I can comfortably say that most of their stuff is pretty true to size. Um, when going on there, just know if you're bigger on if you're bigger on the bottom than you are on top. When you're ordering a, a jumpsuit, um, you're probably going to want to size up. If you're ordering something that has shorts on the bottom, you're probably going to want to size up. If you're ordering something that has like a shorter skirt on the bottom, I know me, I'm going to want to size up. So just kind of get to know your body shape, where it is that you're bigger, where it is that you're smaller, and. If you have smaller legs, I don't feel like you're going to have to size up in a pantsuit. But if you do have bigger chests and bigger up here, then you might want to size up. So you see where I'm going with this? Just kind of learn your body, where you're bigger, where you're smaller. Very, very, very impressed with the more formal dresses, with the pantsuits. Um, I am pretty upset with those black shirts that have that kind of gross smell to them. Um, the more formal dresses did not have that smell, which was nice. I definitely find Shein, Shein to be plus size friendly. And again, I'm very, very, very impressed. I just wish that they could work on the smell in those black shirts because that's a little bit of a turnoff. But for the price of everything else, the jumpsuits, the formal dresses, like I'm just, I'm really, really impressed. And I'm really just kind of like, wow, like go shop 
I really think that you guys will be impressed with the quality of most of the stuff. This is a very inexpensive website. I also want to talk about shipping, you guys. Just because I'm a, uh, they don't know who I am, so I did not get any special, special treatment. I spent all of my own money for all of this stuff. I spent $187. You can't beat that. I got eight, nine, I got 14 pieces of clothing for $184.80. I ordered this just the other day. The, the thing that took the longest was the processing. And when I got my tracking number, I think I got it on Friday. Today is Tuesday. It was on my doorstep on Monday. Shipping was super quick. I was just like, that is not Shein, my Shein order. That is not it. And then I went and I looked at the box and it says Shein on the, on the top. And I was like, what? So shipping was surprisingly very quick for me. I'm very impressed with that. So my overall thoughts are I definitely think it's well worth it. They have an amazing return policy, so if you don't like anything, if that something doesn't fit, you can return it and they completely cover the shipping. You do not lose out on any money. That's one thing that I will say I hate about Forever 21. They have such an awful return policy. That some things you can return to the store, but some things are only online only, and then you have to pay for everything that you ship back. So you're actually losing out on money. Like, why do that? That's not fair. Just because we don't choose the right sizes or we don't like the fabric or something like that, like that, a company should not do that. That's not fair as, as a consumer. So that's one complaint I do have about Forever 21. But yeah, sorry, <laughs> I'm kind of going off a tangent here. But I just want to be very thorough and let you guys know I think this is a great company to shop from. It's hot in here, y'all. I had to open up the door. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you found this video helpful. If you did, don't forget to share it, uh, like it, and subscribe if you haven't yet. And I hope that you guys enjoy the video. Uh, like I said, I have many more try on hauls to come. I hope. <laughs> Why can't I talk? I'm so flabbergasted right now. I don't know. It's hot in here. The light's on. It's got super hot in here. I had the door shut. I love you guys. Have an awesome day. I'll see you in the next one.